Hello, YouTube land. This is my daughter, Olivia Morris. Hello. I've been uh, getting into the hobby of building guitars later. I've already done one, but I'm working on the video on it. I don't have the video finished yet. The guitar is finished, just not the video. And I wanted to... My daughter had mentioned that she would like to burn one. Uh, you know, torch it and, and do wood and uh, wood burning. Wood burning, because that's her hobby, and she's pretty decent at it. And I was looking at buying a blemish kit for eighty bucks for a bass or a hundred bucks for a guitar. The whole kit was there, but I got to looking around. And I found GlaryMusic.com. This thing was a hundred and nine bucks, and it comes with an amplifier. So. Our plan is we're going to tear this thing down, any work that it needs, fret-wise or anything, I'm going to do that. While she takes the body and she has full creative control to do whatever she wants to do to burn the body. Neck will probably leave alone because you want a good smooth neck when you're playing. But the body is going to be all her. It's exciting. <laughs> so I'm going to do an unboxing on this. And we're going to try it out, see how it plays, and look at any issues with it like that. And then I'm going to do a tear down on it, sand any finish off of it, and we're probably going to make a wooden pick guard for it as well. Yeah. And uh, see what we can come up with. So. It's going to be fun. Yes, it is. I think oh, yeah. so. Yep. And also. I may be giving a guitar away come May. Keeps your eyes open on my channel for more details on that as May approaches. I have come fell into a decent little deal on something and I'll explain that more when the time comes. So let's get this thing open. Yeah. comes with a good bag. I watched a lot of videos, review videos on these, and as uh, one gentleman I, I watched says, these are actually dust covers. There's no padding or nothing in them. It's just basically a dust cover. But for that kind of money, 109 bucks, including shipping. <laughs> yeah. I mean, something. Not bad. Comes with a cable, a strap, uh, looks like one red pick in there. No branding or nothing on the pick or anything like that that I see. Guess my as well open the strap up. <laughs> yep, just a little cheap nylon strap. But I think it would hold it on your body yeah. without. As long as it holds it tight. Probably want to get something better in the future if you're serious about it. Cables come in the, all these kits I get, all these cables are about the same. It does come with the uh, Allen wrenches for truss rod adjustment and probably bridge intonation. Actually, fairly heavy. It is. It's thin. Yes, it is very thin. Yeah. Shall we open it? Yep. Leave it for the big reader. Yeah. <laughs> Got a nice strap on it. I mean. It could have been a lot easier with a kit, wouldn't have to do all the sanding and stuff, but heck, for just a few bucks more you get an amp with it, and I don't have a base amp, so... Yeah. To me, it's a no-brainer. I can do some sanding in, in exchange for that. Uh, what's this card? Oh, it's instructions, panel description, all that on your amp, frequencies, all that. It's nice. It is kind of heavy. Headphone connector, MP3 connector, 
signal input. It's got uh, total volume, treble range, mid range, bass range. Okay. It smells brand new. It's got that strap is rubber. Is it? Yeah. It is nice and heavy for a small amp. The speakers fills about five, six inches in diameter from what I can feel there. It's enclosed. It has some weight to it. I yes, wasn't expecting it, really it to be that heavy. Hopefully I got uh, the right angle so you can see that from that camera there. We will try a sound test here in a little bit. Before I tear this thing apart, find out what all it needs, and how it plays. Now for the fun. Okay. You know, they only packaged it in the deal. They did do some nice packaging. All the, uh, yeah. the damage on the outside of the box did not make it through any of the. Uh, styrofoam or anything like that. So. That's there nice. we go. That's a nice copy. Pretty finish actually. So thanks for watching the unboxing. Next we'll have first impressions and possibly the sound test of the bass. And after that tear down and so on as we go. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next part. Bye, y'all.